Hi everyone, welcome to Apple Tech page. Lot of iPhone and Apple Watch users are reporting that Siri keeps saying sorry could you say that again. In this video, I will show you how to fix this issue. First solution is check your internet connection. Make sure that you have a good internet connection. To refresh your internet connection, enable and disable airplane mode. Second solution is turn off and on listen for Hey Siri. To do this, go to Settings app. Tap on Siri and search. Now turn off listen for Hey Siri. Wait for a few seconds and turn it back on. Now you have to set up Siri. Third solution is restart your iPhone. To do this, launch settings app. Next, find and tap on general. Scroll down to bottom and tap on shutdown. Drag the slide to power off slider to right side to turn off your device. Wait for a few seconds and turn your device back on. If you get the same error on your Apple Watch, restart it. If it doesn't work, unpair and repair your watch with iPhone. Fourth solution is update your iPhone to latest version of iOS. For that, go to settings app. Next, find and tap on general. Tap on software update. If new version of iOS update is available, download and install it. Solution 5 is first restart your iPhone. For iPhone 8, 10, 11, 12, 13 and 14 series and iPhone SE second and third generation, do the following steps. Quickly press and release the volume up button. Next, quickly press and release the volume down button. Finally, press and hold the side or power button until you see the Apple logo. For iPhone 7 and 7 Plus, press and hold the sleep or wake button and volume down button at the same time until the Apple logo appears. Solution 6 is Reset All Settings. When you do Reset All Settings, all your customized settings will go back to default settings but no data or media will be deleted. To do this, launch settings app. Next, find and tap on general. Scroll down to bottom and tap on transfer or reset iPhone. Here, tap on reset. Select reset all settings. Then enter your iPhone's passcode. Next, you will get a pop-up window. Tap Reset All Settings. Again, tap to confirm the process. Thanks for watching this video. Do like, share, and subscribe to Apple Tech page.